my name is Emma and this is my let's play of Until Dawn. So Until Dawn is a choose your own adventure horror game. Um, so hopefully you guys get to see some scares out of this. If you are new here, please subscribe to my channel so you can get notified when my next episode goes up. And please go to my channel and check out my review and my unboxing. Without further ado, let's start up some Until Dawn. Hopefully we get some good um, scares. If you guys have seen any of my other Let's Plays before, I am quite freaked out by horror games. So, the butterfly effect, a tiny butterfly flapping its wings may lead to a devastating hurricane. Um, so a lot of this game, as I mentioned, is choose your own adventure. You can go watch uh, other YouTubers play this, you can play this yourself, and you're not really going to spoil everything because there is literally thousands of different um, ways that you can choose your own adventure in this game. So I'm really excited to watch some other people play this too and talk to you guys about what choices that you made. Um, so that's obviously... It looks like veins on the skin actually. Ugh. But um... That's your story in the in the butterfly effect. One of many possibilities. Um, I will have to probably play this a couple of times to get all of it out of it. Choose your actions carefully. Alright, status update. I assume that's like Facebook. You got a status update. Um, so this is the creepy horror cabin in the woods. Sort of like cabin in the woods, uh, but they're in the snow. So, to be honest, I wouldn't go out there. No. Like, I don't care how cool it is to hang out in some creepy wilderness snow. Like, no thank you. Um, and that is also why, no thank you. Ugh. That must be the, um, oh psycho God. killer in the game. Did this. And these are the teenagers. Um, that is Hayden Panettiere, uh, from Heroes. That girl is from Camp Rock, if anyone's seen Camp Rock before. Um, I'm gonna probably start to get freaked out real soon. Alright, where is she heading? Hannah! Alright, where's Hannah? <laughs> <laughs> ah, teenagers. <laughs> I love how teenagers is. Like. She looks like she has the same glasses as me. Mike? It's Hannah. Hey, Hannah. Hmm. Mikey Mike. And this is... Didn't that guy just have a knife before? Is that a gun? He looks hey, weird and creepy that? and... That's it just be us this weekend. She's spotted Josh. him. Alright, now we're in control. Let's do this. So, looks like they've been having... A house party, look at those red cups, um, telltale sign that they're having a house party. Let's pick this up. <laughs> you look so damn hot in that shirt. Um, so oh a booty God. call, a booty note. What did our naive sister get herself into now? And oh. sister. Okay. Um, these guys, uh, obviously had a bit of the special sauce, um, and are very tired, <laughs> slash very drunk. What are they drinking? Jeremiah Craig. I don't know if that is a real alcohol or not, but good for them. Jeez, I think that's the point of going to these creepy cabins when you're a teenager, Once is again, brother, to drink a lot of alcohol. And that's a broiler. Got your note. Glad you can make it. Alright. This booty call is that gonna happen? Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Mm-hmm. Oh hell yeah. Oh my god. Butterfly Shit, tattoo. What? Oh my god. Ah, oh, you've been punked. 
and he's even got a here? GoPro oh. to film it. Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. It's all gonna be just a stupid prank. Uh. Oh. Hey, you guys are jerks. You know that? Hannah! Oh. Such a teenage thing to do. Use the right stick to choose. What we're gonna do. Wake Josh, find the others. Let's find the others, because Josh looks Guys, proper fucked. What the hell? Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. <laughs> what did you do? Classic teenage. Around, it wasn't serious. You jerk! Oh, Hannah, she mad. She mad. Hannah. And rightfully so. You know. But who the hell runs out in the snow? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. Alright. Oh, Press shit. the right actions before the timer runs out. Okay, so these are the quick time events which are in the game. Um, we... Let's go fast. We want to catch it fast. And we make lots of decisions as to how we get through it. Um, Alright, where's she going? I wouldn't be running out there if I saw some crazy man in the woods. Uh, we're going to follow the footprints. Not the noise. Never follow the noise. Please no jump stairs. Ooh! I don't want to run into no deer. A deer is even dangerous. I'm from Australia. I don't even know. I'm gonna get jump scared at any moment now. Um, I'm trying to keep my cool, but on the inside I'm quite freaked out. Alright. Alright. Oh, unlock the phone with the touchpad. We're gonna check our Tinder. Did she have Tinder? She had a Love Heart app. Alright, and I love how she's using her phone as a torch, because who carries torches anymore? Alright, so we're directing the light with the right stick. Please don't jump scare me. Please! I can hear the music getting up right now. Alrighty! That wasn't even a scare! Alright, hold L1 to walk faster. Please. Oh, okay, what's this? Alright, let's pick that up. Is that a... Death totem. Alright. Each totem piece foretells a possible future event. How you play will determine whether or not these prophecies come true. Okay. I'm gonna... <laughs> Fall and die. Um, all right. Let's keep on going. <sighs> I should have a heart rate monitor. You guys would laugh at <laughs> how on edge I am. Come on, Hannah. Why'd you run so far away? I mean, geez. Um, I would be back in that cabin in about three seconds if I saw fire. Alright. There she is. What's wrong with her? Hannah. Hello? Hannah. Oh my god, you must be freezing. Here, take my coat. I'm such an idiot. Aww. So dumb. What the hell is that? Please don't get me. Please. Skills, Hannah. Come on. Classic phone drop. Can't contact anyone. Alright, we're heading back. My god. 
Um, no, no, I am not dropping hammer, no, we are not going with that dude, oh, and that is the death totem, oh, I've killed people already, damn it, ooh, well that's, Damn, I killed people already. And uh, this is this game, everyone can die at any time. Sort of like Game of Thrones. Okay, so now we're in an oh, analyst session, which is outside I of the game. Sure you, understand. you see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom. This revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. The future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single All choice right. will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is he looks really to freaky, to be honest. Sometimes, <sighs> so, sometimes these things can be a little he's going to ask, ask questions which are to do sure with no me. Um, so you guys are going to learn some good stuff about me, probably, of what I'm scared of. Which you can spam my Twitter with, probably. Right. <laughs> we will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what okay. you think about it. It, it is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. So freaky. Alright, let's go get the card. Alright, that is a farm. Farms are creepy. Let's just say that. Really creepy. How did that picture make you feel? What do you see? Does not make me happy. Those, like, things with the corn and the crop circles and the... Ugh. Uh, not the scarecrow. Like, the scarecrow is not the scary part. It's what's... Scary in the cornfields. Is there something in the house? Not in the house. Huh. So, if it's not in the house, then mm -hmm. where do you think it is? Can it be in the field? Yes. It is in the field. Wow. Well, see, and is this threat human or is there some other fear that you have that you would like to talk to me about? No, it's a crazy person in the field. You can see the detail in this game. You can see, like, his stubble on his chin. Um, that looks really cool. Ah, oh, well, perhaps we can explore your fears a bit further in our next session, I'm afraid. We've run out of time. Right. I wonder if they're gonna throw something creepy at me in a in a field. <laughs> I'm still on edge. Like scary games are not my strong suit in any which way. Oh, okay, Sony Computer Entertainment. <sighs> I'm still I'm on edge. Um, Oh death, definitely oh death. All right, this seems like a good place to end the first episode. So please make sure you subscribe to get notified when next episodes go up and to check me out on Twitter if you feel so obliged. Thank you, I'll see you again next time, bye.